Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my channel. The Del Norte is underway. There's people standing all over. <laughs> this is a Montezuma class engine. As you guys saw the last video at the end, we bought this. And so we're going to put her into service. I'm going to have Micah and Javius run, uh, run the train and get these things, uh, start selling product. And I am going to finish the railway out into the valley and get connected up to the smelter. And also the um, the iron mine, so we can start doing some of that stuff while these guys run missions. Now, do will I get experience? I don't get experience, do I, for just building track? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, burgers. I didn't need all the all the all the. Um, the Sorry, chicken, you caught me with my mouth full. That's okay. We, we do not get experience for building track, only for delivering loads and cutting trees. All right. Oh, this is a nice little engine. I'm going to jump off here. <coughs> I'm going to try to get back on before you leave, but we'll see. No, I can't because I'm going to have to wait. Bye. All right, you're set to go into the uh, the warehouse. Uh, the freight depot. Okay, I'm on. Go ahead. Let her let her rip. I've got the switches set for you to go to the freight depot. So Roger do that. so that way you can start selling. Micah. Roger that, Captain Ando. So Micah, can you do logs to the lumber mill, and yeah. then JVS will run freight to the depot. Now that's going to be an interesting one because I don't have a track set up. I don't think to get freight back to the depot to the freight depot. You may have to back, Javius. We'll have to look and see if we can figure out a, a route. Okay. I, I like the you're... sound of this engine. It is nice. Yeah, this is a nice little engine. Yeah, it's all right. <laughs> not not to your likings. Whoa. I walk through your pants. <laughs> yeah, I think you're going to have to back back and forth. I'm sorry. All this spaghetti track you have up here. And yeah, there's no connection back, right? <laughs> Because I figured you'd never be doing that. We're going to go for sale or for. Or out to the. I'll look at it and see what we got. I could probably make it so that we can do it. That's the main line there. I'd like to fix that too if I can. Um, so it looks a little neater. All right. So they're going to run in. I thought there was a, a path. When you at was the way we're going, you pull forward out of the loading area and cross over the lumber track, don't you? Yeah, but that goes back. It goes to the mill or out to the field. So I'm gonna have to let me see what I can do here. Give me a couple, couple give me a couple minutes to figure this out. And I gotta grab this phone call. Hang on. And within seconds, Javius is able to bring the train back out and head on up to our freight depot, except for the switch isn't thrown the right way. Stop, Javius. Why? Javius, stop the train. You're going the wrong way. That How one. do you do it? Back up. It might be past the point of no return. <laughs> what, what was that? I was looking at the other switches down the way. Come on, girl. Come on. Get up, get on the front end. Pick her up. Uh, mm, mm. Okay. 100% reg is not going to work. It. Not going to make it happen. Sorry about that. I'll fix it. <laughs> My bad. Okay. Uh, anyway, you're, you're all set. So what I did was I've, I've, th this is the line coming out. Now, this is a nice new thing that we, I, I haven't tried before and it worked. Um, we, we've got Javius coming out from the sawmill. 
this is our line that's going to go uh, out, and it goes out to the um, the one way goes out to the valley that way, or you can go this way, which goes wise out to the our um, the oil field, ironworks, and refinery down at the bottom there. But I've now added a new switch in, and this is really cool. We've got a crossover here, and you can see here. Now Javius went the wrong way, but we have the crossover here, and this is going to go over to the track. And then he can cross over again, and this goes back to the freight depot. So now Javius can run his train over to the freight depot, and it's basically a giant loop for the sawmill. So wait, we've wait. got even more I, spaghetti. I went the wrong way. I went the way that you. <laughs> hey, I'm still building. I claim no responsibility for switches set the wrong direction. <clears throat> See? And then on the other side of this, we can set an even bigger nightmare situation um, by, let's see, maybe if I go. Am I set now? Can I? Do whatever uh, you got to do now. Oh, no. What? Yeah, because the cars are not far enough back. That's okay. I can make it work. Yeah, you'll make it work. I know you can. I, I, have... will, uh, I will nudge those cars back until I... I can link. I have complete faith in you. What's the worst that could happen? Nothing. Um, well, no, the Montezuma could flip be launched into space, but or the Del Norte, excuse the, me, the Del Norte, the Taco Del Norte. Boop, 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 boop. Okay, so what I'm doing now is I'm still I'm keeping our spacing, and then the great thing is it looks like these spacers worked. So the distance between the cr this is going to sound weird. I'm trying to think of a good way to say this without being confusing. The distance between the crossover, like this distance from this track to this track using the crossover is the same distance as the switches are to each other. So you can use that as a template. What I'm talking about is here, like where, where Javius is right now in the tracks. That crossover distance from here to here is the same as going along here. The tracks are the same distance apart from here to here as they are back at that crossover. So that should make our track laying a little bit easier because now I've got this laid back and I can come back the other way and make our crossover. So what I'm going to do is I, the problem that I was having was that, um, like, how am I going to figure this out? Well, we got to figure it out. Uh, once Javius goes through, I'm going to lay a couple switches. What are all those switches for? I'm just making straight track. You can just make straight track. I know. Certain... I know. This is easier. Trust me. Fa it's faster. Can you guys just get a room, please? And the, the reason why I'm doing it like this, Javius, is because I need them to be exactly the same distance. Because I'm going to make a second one of those crossovers going back over. So okay. trains can get to either set of tracks. My apologies. Yes. I know, But I know it's confusing because it is. My job. It just that looks like the old way of laying track. Yes, yes, I know, I know. There goes the AM and JR. Railroad. JRR. That is awesome. And so now JVS is safely on his way. And I'm going to grab one of these switches and we're going to put have you seen me uh, flip the vehicle in every game we've ever played together so <laughs> that's I why that's, that's why part. safely is a key word and that that will flip him that will flip him so i'm gonna put this down here that's where it's gotta go i'm hoping that this is that gonna be far enough out or is that gonna hit well, you can see here there's a little bit of deviation there. A little deviation. Nothing that we can't fix. It's close enough. And I'm going to run this back. There we go. And we're going to get rid of these. Get rid of that. Okay, so this would be the ideal spot. Mike is in the ideal spot. Mm -hmm. 
and we're going to take, let's see, I need to put one, it's going to be this. Now watch this. It worked. What'd you do? I set up the the uh, wood thing. You guys are going to hate it, but I don't care. Now why did you need one down there? Because the Betsy is getting low on wood. Oh, okay, so just having one down there, is, that's fine. Because... The big logs, you take to reload it to load them up, yeah. right? Yeah, no, I do that sometimes. And go ahead and load yeah. the whole thing up and let's make some money. That's absolutely fine. After you join his company. Yeah, after you join my company. So there's that. There we go. We got a, a pretty straight section going down here. It's all right. I, I, you just tell me what you want to buy and then I'll buy it. <laughs> <laughs> he said, ah. Micah. <laughs> That's fine, whatever. Whatever. It reminds me of those posters. There's no mica in team. That's right. There's no tea in mica either. <laughs> Would you like some tea? He had soup. Close enough. <laughs> it's all hot liquid, right? I love soup. That makes me want to have uh soup. Soup. Yeah. <laughs> well, thank you for that astute. Oh, what the? Why is it doing that? No, I just need to do this. There we go. Why? What? Okay, these crossovers are being really weird. Uh, hold on. I'm doing something wrong. Hmm. <sighs> I just do. So it's got to be this one again. Right, I'll be back, folks. We'll get this laid. Hang on. I'll show you. Say I'm in a good spot. All right. To, so to we have. Oh, no, it's fine. Just leave it. We had it before. We left it on purpose. Um, so we have. What we have here now is the general. And we're going to have to do this again over on the other side. But I have a general crossover. I've got tracks coming out of the sawmill. We've got the main line coming through. And then we have this. This way, if a train needs to get over there, it can. If a train's coming on this line and needs to get over to the right, it can. So it basically allows tr all trains to get to all tracks. There's the second crossover up at the end of the track here. And for right now, this is the end of the line. We're not going to run this out yet to the industry because we don't need it because there's nothing out there that we need. So um, I've got these here, and we're just going to leave these. And so hopefully no one will switch those and die. But now I'm going to go over to the other side and run that track. So I'm going to get going on that, and I will catch up with you guys in a few moments. Those curves. Yeah, I know. they're, And it's the main line, too. That's the great part. The one you're on looks worse. Really? Right off the switch. Wow. It works. Cool. That's the tighter uh, curve that you're on right now. Did you see how close those cars were to touching the corners of them? Back it through. Let's take a look. Hey, as long as they work, that's all I care about. That's. <laughs> I don't know what else to do there. We have to get from one place to another pretty quick, and that's, that's the only thing I can think of that we can do. <laughs> Plus, everything else is all interconnected there. <laughs> no, they're not bad. There there's a go. there's at least half a foot. Okay. Yeah, yeah five four Gee, inches. Right. They're close. Like, so this is going to be a real slow speed corner to keep from jerking the cars off the track. Yeah. Which is fine. Except Maybe. Fine. Except for but, what? <laughs> except it's a main line, so. It... Yeah. Unfortunately, <laughs> this section that's how it's going to be. Sucks. That's weird. Sucks to be I me. I don't. I don't think you. I don't think I get money for dropping the logs in that. Uh, in that thing. Yeah, you do. Are you loading them onto a car and then on and then into the firewood depot, or are you loading yes. directly into the firewood depot? No, I'm onto a car and then the car drops them into the depot. Okay. You're all good. So, not great, but that's about as good as it's going to get. Well, it'll work. 
Oh, you're right. It I do. It just doesn't refresh. Okay. Well, that's right. You're keeping the money. I'm looking at mine. I'm like, am I getting more money? No, because Mike is keeping it. No, it's just the, the depot. I was just testing to see if the depot was working. I'm just pulling your leg. And I'm not pulling your leg, and I'm keeping the money. Okay. <laughs> 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 oh, well, what can you do? That is, I, that's the only part of this track I don't like is that, that curve. Everything else is, except for, well, yeah. I mean, what else could I do, Javius? Well, there's so much going on right now that, and everything is built off of something else. To to change it, you would be pretty much stuck with a pretty large rebuild. I don't know. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, you could move the main line to be parallel to the first line you ran down here to the... Yeah. And then it's break it where it heads towards the sawmill and continue it towards the valley and then have your tracks branch off from there. Rebuild your connection to this complex. But honestly, how many trains are going to run through here from the smelter to the iron mine one like the coal a coal train i don't foresee so from the smelter <coughs> you have rails, rails oh yeah and iron uh, uh, go to the industry area okay you have lumber products both types go to the industry area so they're just going to have to run slow when they go through here. And then, and then you have coal <clears throat> from the coal mine to the okay. industry area. Okay. Yeah, the lumber's easy because that's already set from that end. But the the trains that the coal and the um, iron stuff is going to have to go. They're just going to have to go slow through here. That's the only caveat. They're going to have to slow. I mean, they honestly, they probably can go through full speed, but. For realism's sake, uh, they would have to slow. <laughs> I'm going to tell you there's no way in hell they're going to make it through there and at full speed. Babyest <laughs> language, sir. He's not. <laughs> we're in between. No, I'm recording. <laughs> well, you didn't say that. You said you were going <laughs> to. I want a video of you going through it. You're fine. It's Don't worry about it. It's fine. Life will go on. Um, I thought you were had broken away while you built the next section of track no but we're good i didn't hear you uh bring us back i apologize <laughs> i try very hard not to <laughs> on your streams because i know that's not your thing i have my moments but you growl a lot <laughs> <laughs> the I growl. Uh, my, my personal railroad that i built which has much more generous curves i've tossed cars off of yeah and not even going full speed right <clears throat> so it's it's possible okay what i wish they had a we... slow sign like slow no kidding um, I'll, I'll rethink some of this. Maybe. I mean, the other option is to make a bridge over troubled waters. Yeah. And, and then the great to get up over the bridge is going to be what? 10% to get up there. Cause we don't really have a lot of room. Right. <laughs> no, we can make it. <laughs> Let me look. Yeah, I think you're right. It's, we have to be 3%. Most times, Javis is right. I've got a back to there, but it could go further back. I am coming out of the sawmill towards the freight depot, the opposite direction from I just came in. I don't know if you messed with any of that. Track. No, I don't think so. 
I'm pretty sure I left it alone. I, I think up to eight hundred bucks, so I'm good. I, I, I think we could. I think I could get up and over. Do you mind if I try? Do I mind if you try something? Yeah. Like the game. Well, that's a good point. I'm gonna try and see what happens. All right, folks, we'll be back. I'm gonna try something. We got Javius coming down the line. I am building my bridge for the main line. What I decided while you guys were gone, is it going to fit? They fit. Okay, good. Um, I decided to go to a single line instead of a, main, a dual main line. It's not as cool, but it makes this in here a lot simpler. And it also gets rid of all the double track spaghetti that was going on through here. So what I'm doing is the main line now is running up here. Uh, and I've passed it over this here without having it. So it's a nice 2% uh, grade going up from the valley on this bridge and then it's going to swung over here and we've crossed both the line going to the depot and from the depot back to the sawmill there so the sawmill loop goes through this way and then heads out that way and then I'm going to be turning it this way and descending back down to ground level for our run into the oil fields once I hit the ground, I'll be joining up this second track uh, over there coming out of the sawmill. So they'll join together and make a nice run. And so far, so good. So it's going real smooth now. Um, and so I'm going to go ahead and get that done. We'll, we'll run a train over so you guys can see it when we're done um, just to test it out. So we will see you guys momentarily. Javius is leaving the sawmill here, and I'm up on my bridge. But we're going to have to do a rescue mission. Because Javius has crashed again. His game crashes every time he leaves the sawmill for some reason. You think it's the crisscross that makes it do that? I have no idea. All right, I got the brake on it. It's just, it's just past the trestle. Just, just let it go. I've, I've braked it. I braked it so you can get oh, it. No. It's Oh, you're at the rest, depot? Let it go. I'm back in and at the freight depot, so I'll run okay. toward catch okay. it. I'll let her I'll let her rip. <laughs> I'm setting her for about 40%. 34%, no brakes. She'll be there. What a cute little engine. Cute. That's the tough version. Don't forget to um set the uh the monetary system extreme to extreme yeah so that i can have some money Give i have 209 simoleons at the moment i am 4200 375 i see micah running by hello where are you going just bored are you are you done with the sawmill huh are you bored with the sawmill just need to do something else just for, for a few minutes. That's fine. Uh, all right. So I got this going right. over here. For those of you that didn't see, we cross over these two tracks. And my track is heading back down. I keep having to hop off, though, to get lumber cut so that we're not. Um... Now, this will be interesting here because this hill's over here. I'm going to have to really watch what I do. Oh, no. Oh, <sighs> This is a pain in the butt. That doesn't get any better. The the downside is you still we still have these issues where if you fall off the track you're really skunked. Why don't you, you know, just build a, a platform? I'm going over to. Here. I don't really want to, but Okay, why won't this incline? What the frick? Incline. Oh, there's voice commands? No. <laughs> Did I turn the numlock hey, off or something? Build my track. Yeah, really. Jeez. Oh, that was the old days. Hey, Javius, build my track. I want it long and strong. Oh, I got to do it after. Okay. <laughs> that ain't working. I'll try it from here. No, that's the other weird thing that I got to get used to. It doesn't, uh, 
the tracks don't necessarily snap when you're in circle mode. They don't snap to the direction that you necessarily want. They just kind of go where they're going. Okay, there we go. And I'll just delete this once I get on my rails because this is the last piece. Um, so demolish that. Yep. And then let's grab our Denver and Rio Grande Bridge pieces. And we're going to put it here. And it's not going to be 10 up. We're going to be doing two down. Two down. And is it going two down? Yep. And I'll continue doing this till we get down to the ground. And at this point, I think we can start straightening out. <gasps> Crap. I hate the fact that you have to pick that every single time. Because I'm too picky. All right, I'm hopping down, and we're going to run this all the way down to the ground. Let's see. Micah, I'm going to... Keep pointing straight. Yeah, I'm going to start cutting back on the curve. If you could kill this tree directly in front of me. Okay. Death. Death to the tree. Death to green. Okay. You two sound like you're auditioning to play Batman. Uh, Micah, could you I cut this tree in front of me? Tree farmer. <laughs> and then the other one, too. And the sister. Okay, Arthur, I have joined your right. company, but not after earning enough money to buy a fourth cordwood car. Okay, that's fine. So that leaves very little in my bank account, but four cars in the yard waiting for you. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Thank you. And you can start putting money into your own account now then. I'm going to go see. I don't. The pr problem is. Okay, Micah, we're going to have to adjust our corner here. The good news is I think we're below tree height. And hill height, so right about here should be good. I can't believe this is a 2% grade. Are you laying track as you go? Um, yeah. Because I was thinking about cutting the trees as you run through. I don't you think you can. Yeah, just... Unfortunately, I think we're going to have to do it the weird way. Um, there we go. All right, so it's laid. And then... I'll get it down to the ground. It's going to be straight now. We're going to start heading back the other way. Oh, I can't get up there. Come on. Oh, there we go. But the, it's low enough now that we can get the trees from the platform. Before, when I was up high, I couldn't cut the trees down because it was it was so high. It was not allowing me to do it. So anyway, we've got that run, guys. Uh, we'll be back in a minute. Mr. Micah's going to get going. We're going to have to all probably get going here soon. But uh, Mr. Micah wanted to say goodnight, so... Here Good go. night, everybody. <laughs> Good night, Mr. Micah. Micah. Oh, Javis back. Good night, Javis. You guys have a good one. Have fun now. Hey, we will. We will. <laughs> we won't do too much more without you. Yeah, uh, it's okay. <laughs> All right, good get night. Get her Micah. done, man. Give yeah, her get her done. Bye. Bye. All right, so what I'm doing here is I'm trying to get this. Oh, is it not going to let me? Well, I guess if we go. Let's see. Uh, we put this. I want this needs to go. Um, let's see. Gonna turn this down to one degree. Oh lordy, will it go through? That's the question. I don't think circle mode's off. I gotta find this other track where it comes out. Let's see if this can all join up. Uh, what is that? Hey, Javius. Yes. Are you able to do me a solid? What's that? Where are you right now? I'm at the by yard. Oh, okay. Never mind. No, I mean, I can be there relatively. Oh, I got it. I got it. I just, I needed to get 
I, I walked over with the track, but then I realized we have a, we had a stopper in there. Oh, uh, <laughs> you need to stand there and wait. Yeah. So I wonder what this. Oh, we're at negative two. That's part of the problem here. Uh, zero grade. Nope. <laughs> okay, so let's put another one of these, like, seriously, like, right on the... Ah, oh, come on. And we're going to do this. You'll see what I'm doing here. This looks crazy, but... You, too, can make Spaz Track a reality in your life. All right, so those four cordwood cars okay are now um, spotted and coupled together and spotted forward oh. out of the by yard so you can fill the the track behind it again. Okay. I uh I used Micah's hand car to <laughs> That's tedious work. No, no. Well, I re-railed them onto the same track with a gap between them. (laughs) Right. So I could just put the hand car there and push one car until it got rolling enough. And then, all right. So this is our line going from the sawmill out to the field it is kind of steep uh what is that Eh, maybe not can i switch onto that line yet which line the bridge line oh geez um not yet like you want to ride the bridge yeah yeah um no not yet well, I'm just leaving the freight depot, so you've got like a minute to finish. Well, no, it's good. Well, I'm a long way away from that. I got to make this. This is going to have to be. This is not the main line, so it's not a huge deal. But I still don't want it to be that steep of a turn. Let's try to go. Nope, not 180. There we go. 10. 50. We'll take it. 50. It's going to be a 50 turn, which sucks, but why won't this? That's significantly better than a 30. Yeah. I don't think. I, well, we have a couple 30s, but this one, right? We'll do it. Yeah, it's doing it. Okay. Get up. Oh, we're going to have to start heading down. Yeah. So I'm going to... This will be a 2% downgrade from here. Track laying is always fun. All right. I'll be back, fellas and ladies who are watching. We'll be back in a moment. Javius is testing the trestle that we have built. And by the way, I put a long, a pretty long stopping track at the other end, so you should be okay. Okay. There's our sawmill. Hey, you made it. It didn't derail. No. I also pulled the throttle down to nothing. That's all right, though. It's, it went over smooth. Yeah. They didn't jerk or anything. Well, in real life, you wouldn't just throw the throttle at 100%. Hope for the best. Right. We'd actually have to drive it. There you go. And that's the line down there that goes back to the sawmill. It ran smoother than uh, smoother than I was expecting through that S-curve, too. 
So it works. And then if you want to throw the switch and come the other way and go underneath, let's see if it goes, if it clears. I, I saw think... a problem over here with one of the tracks. It could be just a visual glitch. I want to check this real quick because it looked like this switch was really cattywombus. That was exactly what I was planning on doing. What's that? Backing up through here and then going through the low track when you just connected. That looks really bad. Um, this is going to go here. Nope. Yeah, that one's got a little bit of a steep curve, so I'm concerned slightly about it. Um, let's go take this through here. And back on the low line. The low line. I find myself on the low line quite often. No, just two is fine. Nope. And we're going to connect up right there. And I'm going to turn circle mode off. And we're just going to connect this up to where Javius is. He'll be coming around the mountain when he comes. So we're getting there. We got this nice trestle crossover. Cleans up this area significantly, though we still have a lot of tracks coming in and out because they're going to all different kinds of places. But I feel like I accomplished my goal of getting the trains, you know, to all the different points from that sawmill. Because the sawmill really is kind of the the point where that happens. Is Does it go through the bridge okay? Did you make it through? Um hitting the curve to go swing under the bridge right now. How's that curve? Is it okay? It's a little tight, but you don't really have a choice to make this happen. Yeah. And here we go. We may, we've got clearance with this locomotive. It's a small boy, but ooh, this one's, this one's tight too. So should I change that out for a steel structure? The bridge? Yeah. No. And then move the train over? I mean, we could scoot it over further. No, it's... It's I fine, you think? Do, I wouldn't do that unless you've got a locomotive that ends up being too tall. Okay. And so it goes through. There we go. So all of our lines are connected back up and we have the new line that runs from the field over there to the across the valley over there. Um, and so that's pretty neat. So that gets us now to the point where I am ready to run. We've run the track through the valley. Uh, I am ready to run our, um, our line across uh, my idea, and you'll see it when I'm done, but uh, my idea is to run, see where it says smelter, and we got the valley just south of that. I'm going to run straight across, like to the south of the smelter, and then have a track that goes back around and curves, works its way down to the smelter. Um, and possibly one coming up the other way back into the valley. So we'll have to see how that pans out. Um, and then there's going to be another track going up to the iron ore mine. Um we used to run on the uh, western ridge, but we're going to run this just on the eastern ridge and make a loop. So we'll see how that works. <laughs> so, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Track Laying 101. Uh, how not to build your railroad into, well, you, how to build your railroad into complete spaghetti. But everything goes everywhere, and it seems once you have the roots and you know the roots, it's pretty easy to figure out where you're going and where you're going to end up. So... Anyway, did you have fun, Javius? I did. Me I too. Four times. There you go. That's a new record. You. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good thing or not, but. <laughs> no, it's not. It's not but, a great thing, uh, though. 
The only derail I had was when you uh, had left me uh, lined up for a dead end for a track that didn't exist. Yeah, so. see? See? I did that on purpose. All right, ladies and gentlemen, have a great night. Be sure to subscribe, and we'll see you next time as we continue to build our railroad. Good night. Bye. Say good night. <laughs> see you next time, everyone. Bye. <laughs>